Tournament time. Dayton and UMass for your Friday night. Alex Mike is seeing Richardson on the recap as Dayton earning the home game as the number two seed. Boy, early, they were on it, Ian. Diana Benigno, great chance. Mendoza, really good save. Yeah, excellent cutback, decent strike, good save, and then minutes later, the important moment of the first half. Yeah, and it was the link up. It was other way, though. Benigno finding Jamelli her 12th of the season. And really, Ian, kind of interesting, fourth minute, Dayton gets that one nothing lead. That was kind of all UMass. Bonavita a chance here. It was the minute women that were on the front foot. They were certainly the more threatening after the goal. Dayton really struggled to keep the ball in the final third. UMass kept coming at them without creating anything really clean in front of goal. UMass played two times here in the tournament a year ago, lost in the championship game to St. Louis, and it looked as if they were going to get back to the semifinal, but they just were not able to get even, and they went one nothing at the break. We get into the second half, and uh, UMass still trying to find that goal, and credit Batu Reda was really solid tonight, and uh, Dayton uh, for Talia Jamelli earning the corner kick, Here's that crucial second goal. Yes. Alicia Donnelly, third goal in three games. Good delivery from Heg. Donnelly knows what she's doing. She's coming in at a back post. Not the greatest from Mendoza. She gets the flight of the ball all wrong. Donnelly's in there with easy tapping. And uh, Dayton able to just do it on the defensive end. Mackenzie Lutz was a superstar tonight. They are a challenge on Bonavita. And Batul Reda, her fifth shutout of the season. And now Dayton will look to watch Loyola St. Louis for tomorrow as the Flyers a winner, 2-0 uh, over UMass.